Hi golfers, Nick here from Nick Taylor Golf. It's Friday, so welcome to a special edition of Golf Tips. I've got my friend here, Oscar from Sweden. He's gonna do a bit of short game. Like, obviously I do quite a lot of long game on the channel. Don't do too much short game. And I thought I'd grab this man while I've got opportunity just to do a bit of short game. So he's gonna to talk to you guys today a little bit about how to aim the face, how to play high, how to play low shots, and play some medium shots around the green. So, Oscar. I see you've got the, oh, the got rod on the face there. So just give us a quick little insight into that, because I thought it was really interesting, just listening to you earlier, talking about how important the club face aim is. I like this, uh, the magnet with the stick pointing out, because it gives you the, the club face normal, yeah. uh, which is actually what you aim with. So you shouldn't, a lot of people think they aim with their, with the grooves on the club. So whenever you, whenever I tell someone to open their face and the groove's pointing out to the right, they're terrified, yeah. which uh, shouldn't be the case. Okay. So we can change the club face normal a few different ways. Yeah. I can spin the shaft. Yeah. If I close so it, points it's going to the loft it, point it left. Yeah. If I open it, it's going to add loft, point it to the right. Yeah. And then I can raise and lower the handle, which is going to shift the club so, face normal. So when you raise the, the handle, that points the face more to the right? To the right. Uh, when you lower it, it points it more to the left? Yes. Okay. So the way I use that with chipping and pitching from a standard position, just having the club neutral, that would be my standard shot. Okay. And that would be an expected outcome, an expected height. Okay. So that's, was that medium shot? Um, this one was a little bit lower than a medium. Okay. Okay, so that's about a medium that's trajectory, a, yeah? That's my medium. Okay. So if I Not would want to hit it lower, I would... So to hit it lower? To hit it lower, I would close the face, yep. and I would raise the shaft. Okay, so you're, you're de-lofting the face, but... De-lofting the face, closing it, raising the shaft to point it square again. Okay, good. So give us a little demonstration on that. So, so this would be a low shot. So it's Obviously closing the this face. Changes my setup. Raise, raise the handle. Do you stand in a little bit closer? Yep. Yep. I would stand where the shaft tells me to stand. Okay. Really good. So then the opposite to that would be to the play opposite, like a high shot. The opposite would be twisting it the other way, opening the face. Opening the face points out to the right. Yeah. Lowering the handle points it square again. Yeah. Obviously, this is going to change my setup again. So if I do it first with the club. The butt end tells me where, I, where I'm supposed to stand. Okay. Like Beautiful shot. So, I find it a quick and easy way just to change, change flights, change outcomes. Really interesting stuff there, Oscar. Like, I thought I was really impressed. I watched your clinic earlier. Uh, and obviously with that magnet on the, on the face there, it just obviously shows the students exactly what's happening with the face angle. Yeah. And you've demonstrated that absolutely awesome. So, thanks for... Thanks Thank for doing you. that, I appreciate that mate. Thank you very much. A pleasure. Cheers man. By the way guys, you can follow Oscar uh, Instagram. At, I'll put uh, the links on the screen. At uh, Almond Golf. Um, at Almond Golf. Almond Golf. Instagram. I'll put, it, I'll put his links on there, I'll put his Facebook on there. Do you do any YouTube? Nope, not yet. Not yet, maybe one day. It's very impressive stuff. So guys, thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon. I'm not saying this well, am I?